Hey everybody, so yeah, I'm about to get ready for church. So right now I'm just gonna do the weigh-in and uh, yeah, so we're gonna see how week one of Rose 170 went. And hopefully, and I know I lost weight because I better have because I worked out like heck. Um, so yeah, we're gonna weigh ourselves. Excuse the the grandma robe. I know. <laughs> I was 211.6 last week, so. Okay, so I am 207.6 now, so that's. I lost four pounds in week one. Um, and yeah, so that's all I want to discuss right now. So I'll talk to you guys like in the next clip. Bye. Hey, everybody. So as you can see, um, I lost four pounds. Four pounds, and how I did that was majority. And mind you, let's rewind. How was everyone's MLK weekend? I was supposed to come video Sunday, and I recorded actually a video, but it was so dry, like it wasn't. It was just all over the place. So I was like, I can't put that up. And then my face was dry. It was everything was dry by the video. So I was like, um, I'll just wait till Monday to record it. And then Monday came. We were just doing community service, and then I hung out with my girls. So now it's Tuesday. I'm finally recording. I'm sorry if the lights looks really like dark in here. If I cut on the lamp, it's gonna be too bright. If I cut on the light, it's not gonna do anything. So it is what it is with that. Um, so yeah, how did I lose those four pounds? It was majority fitness. Like I will give myself an A plus plus extra credit on fitness because I did insanity. I started insanity with my roommate um last week. <clears throat> And we did a dang thing. Um, was I sore? <laughs> was I sore? Like, when I say I was walking down the stairs like a mummy, like, just, <gasps> like, it was ridiculous. Like, the first four days, my legs were so sore. Like, and then the fact that you're the key, you can't stop doing it, like, or you're just going to have to restart all over again. Like, I was walking around with noodle legs, like, a newborn baby deer, like, just, if you touch the back of my knee, I'm going to fall. Like, it was just ridiculous. So, but yeah, I took a break. So, today I'm going to restart Insanity. Not restart, but continue Insanity. Um, because I took this weekend off. Just, you know, because MLK weekend, you know? It's a free weekend. And I had a great time, um... So my goal is to lose four pounds this week. It's Tuesday and I've been doing bad, y'all. I'm gonna lie. The, as far as dieting, I've been doing kind of crappy, but uh, it's Tuesday. I have five more days to lose four pounds. Um, try to get to two o three, and so yeah, really, I have to work on getting my um, veggies and fruit and just the, this, the healthy stuff. And I've done good today. Um, just yesterday and Sunday, I kind of went off the deep end <laughs> with that. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. And also like, I was just thinking about, I need to stop focusing on the what ifs, like, what if I just had a good day? What if I started last year? Or what if, what if this and that situations, because it gets you nowhere. Like, if you dwell on the past and what you could have done, you'll never, like, see your future because you're just living for the past, not living for today. And that's what I kind of need to work on because I'm always thinking about, like, if this situation worked out, where would where would I be right now? You know what I mean? Or if I did this, what could have been the outcome? And it's just, like, you can't go backwards in your story. You can't. All you can do is move forward. So it's just, like... I have to live each day improving myself um, and doing better and pushing myself to do more. Like when I say I have so many things I need to do, but I would just be in this bed chilling like I don't have nothing to do and I'd be wide awake. Um, so I need to start pushing myself to do better in every aspect of my life just to improve. You know, there's there's always need for improvement, no matter how perfect you are, no matter how much weight you lose, no matter how far you get in school or your job or your family or whatever the case may be, there's always need for improvement for yourself. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it, I think. My goal's four pounds. Hopefully I make it. I will make it, not hopefully. Hopefully I, I will definitely make those four pounds. 
Um, that's like a pound a day starting now. I haven't weighed myself since Sunday, so I don't know if I gained any weight from these past two days. But hopefully I'm like 203, 204. Um, I hate setting goals because if I don't reach it, it's just like, ugh, kill me. But I just want to go down, really. I just want to keep going down. I don't want to have no surprises. Um, because if, even if I did gain weight, I would know that it was my fault or whatever. So I just started doing better. Um, and shout out to all the people, with all the love y'all showed me in the last video. Like I had all the sharing. Shout out to, of course, I am Miss Honey Bee. Hey girl. <laughs> How, uh, also Sharnice Nanya and Alicia Vene. Hey Alicia. You know, Alicia, Alicia. Um, thank you for showing me love. I would definitely love your, you guys to keep commenting. Tell me you, about your weight loss journey or, you know, what you're doing. Just tell me anything. It doesn't matter. I will definitely reply. Um, like, comment, subscribe, all of that. And I will see you guys next week. It's a short video. I have nothing else to talk about. So, yeah. All right. Love you guys. Bye.